This was mine. Now it's yours. Stand straight, Paul. <coughs> Your father is a cripple. He took your grandmother's life when he was... Oh! <laughs> I'm going to get you! No, you're not! <laughs> no! No, please! You should have seen us. We... We were one with our horses. The f I, the great gen force to be reckoned with. We stood at the gates of Paris. <coughs> the gates of Paris. <sighs> we could have had it all. Everything. December 28th, 1916. Magdalena and I hardly exchange a word.
too long I have allowed my cowardice to paralyze me. But I'm... October 13th, 1917. I have ordered our factories to cease the production of ordnance and arms with immediate effect. October 10th, 1917. says the answers I seek are in the basement. But he won't let me down there. You hold redemption in your hands, the key to everything, Omega, between red and blue.
August 26th, 1916. I had a peculiar dream. It was my 32nd birthday again, and I was visiting father in Africa. Just as I did back then, I shot the gazelle. Use the iron dissolving tank eater, combine three parts of the enclosed chemical compound, which I have named Wilhelmswasser, with one part hydrochloric acid. A three to one ratio is essential. The combination will only produce tank eater acid if the proportions are exactly correct.
the identity of our new company Führer was no coincidence. Him, of all people, aren't he? Is it here? I... I wish I could trust you. Truly, I do. But my mission comes first. I can't risk it for anything. Secure the explosives depot. And then... Bring me proof I can trust you. Proof that you're not in league with the enemy. That I don't have to fight this accursed battle alone. Now go!
as ordered, the great lieutenant of them.
the shockwaves all the way back here. What happened? Did you clear the gun positions? Prove it to me! to be sure. I hope you can understand that. <sighs> Not a bad shot for a blind man, eh? <laughs> oh, my eyes. <clears throat> they still hurt. Uh, but uh, I can uh, see much clearer now. Much... and running again. We'll have all the explosives we need to win the war.
autumn is upon us again. Oak 
October 13th, 1917. I have ordered our factories to cease the production of ordnance and arms with immediate effect.
Last will and testament. I, Lothar von Schmidt, being of sound body and mind, hereby decree that my grandchildren be afforded every opportunity to become honorable and upstanding officers. They shall both visit the Cadet Academy. For this reason, and no other, I have chosen to finance both my son's house and his trivial business activities. Likewise, for this reason and no other, do I hereby name him my sole heir. Only the golden dagger I received from the Kaiser for my accomplishments in the colonies do I leave to my grandson, Paul. I shall not tolerate any alterations to my room in the salon of my son's house, nor any attempt on the part of his wife or her family to sully my grandsons with their uncultured language nor Catholic superstitions. My son's wife shall bear a German name. Lothar von Schmidt. Berlin, May 8th, 1908. Descend like an easterly wind. A prom Ah! <sighs> 